Hello everybody, you, uh, Dark Dark Lord of Sword here. Er, uh, I did say there was some fancy stuff coming, so here's a ritual dagger that I put together. Uh, unlike most of my normal pieces, it is not made of pine. This blade is made of basswood, which is very soft and readily available, and can easily be worked with hand tools instead of needing to be you know, cut with a bandsaw or any saw for that matter, or, uh, or needing a, a a belt sander in order to shape it. Yeah, this was primarily done with a little bit of help from a Dremel, but mostly with hand sanding. Yeah. Uh, the guard and pommel are epoxy sculpt, and the grip is... This is actually the first flat wrap I've done in a very long time, instead of my usual spiral wraps, but that is textured faux leather. I might actually do some more stuff to that. I might give it a little bit of... Uh, I got some iridescent paints recently and I got and the black one has a nice gold shimmer to it so I might give that give the hilt a uh, a little once over with with some of that at and dry brushing and the design on the blade was achieved by using the edge of a Dremel sanding drum and just sort of letting that carry itself and then going back and filling it in with a gold leaf paint pen At some point, I, I will actually get myself a camera mount so I can record the build process. Let's, let's, and actually show you how I achieve some of this stuff. Uh, the pommel is interesting because it is a... It's an onion shape. Yeah, that I made by wrapping a lump of epoxy sculpt around the end of the grip. And working it into a rough cone and then... When it had set, taking it to the belt sander and letting it spin. And then adding the little curved accent pieces after that. I'm very pleased with how this came out, but let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll catch you in the next video. Dark Lord out.